What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and we have another Pokemon opening. Uh, apologies for the lighting. I know that this is what happens when I record during the day, and yeah, just a lot of sun comes in. The blinds aren't very good. I've been meaning to buy some more blackout curtains, <laughs> but I just haven't gotten around to it. So today we have a Hidden Fates Raichu tin plus another one of these Mew Mewtwo tag team boxes. This product, guys, is real actually really good. Um, the expect or if you play competitive in my opinion it's totally worth it i think some of the mewtwo if you just buy a single of the mewtwo from the actual set i think they're basic they're pretty high in price i think like in 20 or a lot of listings i've seen have been like over 20 so at that point like this thing i think retails for 25 so completely worth it and the reason i'm opening this i did have a buddy that does need one of these cards not the code this time, but another one of the promos. So I want to open one just to grab it for him. And ooh, wow. Hmm, look at that. You can see that the pack has moved quite a bit. Hopefully it's not damaged. Might be damaged. <laughs> that is disappointing. So, got about a billion of these at this point. Don't really care about that. This promo is what we're here for. And yeah, if you play competitively, use this code, you can make your Mewtwo deck. Finally, that's how I managed to get my Mewtwo's. I think I managed to pull one. Although I never really opened a lot of Unified Minds on PTCGO. Just gonna see this bad boy real quick. So, let's see what else is going on these days. I didn't show this, I didn't show that. We are doing well on Hidden Fates all of a sudden. And we're gonna keep that going. We got another tin, but let's go through these packs. We'll kind of speed through these. We have evolutions. What do we? I feel like it's been a while since we got a good pull in evolutions, any kind of mega or anything like that. So let's do it. Three. All right, for our first pack, super potion, Charizard, Spearling, plus a Charmeleon. All right, all things are go for our mega Charizard. We have Ponyta. Vulpix is our reverse. Ooh, ooh, Electrode. Lisa's not one of the one. I'm pretty sure Electrode was a Lisa rare. And ooh, I can see the the face cam is the lighting is terrible. Apologies. Ah, uh, this terrifying fish. That is Bruxish. Is that like a reused art? I could have sworn that the Bruxish in one of the sets was a rare. All right, Skip Bloom, very good card for that Lost, lost March. Lost March. Uh, ooh, a Nuzzle Dedene. Nuzzle Dex. I think people are still trying to make that work. We got a Stunfisk, Super Troll card, and then a Electivire. So far, this tin is not so good, but Unified Minds. Let's see, which one's a damage? Let's see how. If any cards were damaged in the package it wow this thing like just melted um looks okay and we do have a green code card too so that would be very disappointing if something got damaged this is the rare looks okay all right crisis averted we got a munchlax magneton the barrel finian a lolan grimer carablast a fletchling Hone Edge. Ooh, look at that Magmar. He looks cool. He looks kind of like a like a final boss just walking up to you. And then, whoa! All right, we got a Secret Rare Tag Switch. Very nice. I just want to make sure. Ooh, okay. We, ooh, for real, Crisis Averted. Uh, what's this? Move up to two energy from one of your tag team Pokemon to another one of your Pokemon. I feel like I've never seen that used, but that does sound pretty good. When, um, let's say you're, well, actually it doesn't matter what, what you're using, what uh, kind of deck, because you can use any energy, but, you know, you, you're just re retreating your tag team out to pull in another one just because it has a lot of damage on it, and this basically moves the energy over there, so that does sound pretty good. Uh, I don't think it's used, but, ooh, that's a sick pull right there. Alright, let's continue this luck into the Hidden Fates tin, I thought we saw this last pack. Alright, so another successful Tag Team 10. Again, big fan of this product. I feel... Ooh, Tortuga! There we go. 
grab a perfect fit for you. And I feel like we opened, I don't even know how many boxes of Unified Minds, pulled very few Tortugas, and then we just opened these one-off tins, and now the Tortugas are coming. Ah, there we go. Very good tin at this point. But kind of like, I have a feeling the same thing's gonna happen for Cosmic Eclipse, but I feel like Hidden Fates just kind of uh, overshadowed these tins. For our last pack, we have a Mag Border to go with the Magmar. That's pretty cool. It's kind of like Magmar plus Iron Man equals Mag Mortar. <laughs> Alright, so a very good tin. Move these off to the side and let's get into our Hidden Fates. But yeah, cos actually no, Cosmic Clip, I think it's November. But I have a feeling the Hidden Fates hype is going to be going strong well into that release. We're definitely going to do some Cosmic Eclipse. I want all those character rares. So we'll see how that pans out. Let's see. If you guys haven't joined our Discord yet, I definitely encourage you to do so. Things have been super lively and a lot of good conversation going on. And kind of like, whenever I see a deal, I'll almost always post it on there. Just because... Well, uh, sometimes I'll do it in a video, but simply <clears throat> when when I see it and when I plan to do the next Oh, usually, you know, you get one of each pack, but this is one of the situations we got. Two Mews, two Mewtwo's. Mews first. Yeah. Join the Discord. <laughs> Alright, Hidden Fates, here we go. This was what... This is the primary main attraction. Here we go, Electric Energy, more Magmars, Brock's Grit, Chansey, Magikarp, Geodude, Clefairy, Eevee, Ekans, Arbuck. Ekans into Arbuck with Sabrina Suggestion to wrap up. So nothing good on there, I need to make some space. Here we go, into pack number two. this point ETBs should be out so hopefully everyone is able to get some uh, if you got your pre-orders cancelled I feel your pain same thing happened to me basically 75% of my pre-orders were cancelled super disappointing but we'll move on hopefully I think I managed to do some other pre-orders to a GameStop I did have to pay more but Bill's analysis for our rare shiny Curlia I think this is number four. <laughs> Once, um, at some point, I think we'll start doing. I don't know, maybe we'll do like a giveaway or something where you can pick up whatever. Oh man, my pals are all messed up. I'm just gonna put some over here. Pick up, uh, like of all the dupes I have, if any of them that you are looking to pick up, we'll do giveaways for that or something like that. Or maybe we'll just do it through the Discord. I'm not sure. But I'm getting lots of dupes. Especially around Curlia. Pulling a lot of Giovannis and Jesses and James, which is awesome. Let's see, what else have we been pulling a lot of? Even some good ones like Malamar. Um, I think that, or, I'm sure there's others. Clefairy. A Jolteon. A lot of Clefairies, too. Alright. Last pack. Man, my nose is running. Uh, so far, this has been a less than average box hopefully we can pick it up with this last pack only one shiny so far that is not a good that is not a successful opening trying to get a shiny gx as always that's definitely the area of the most ground to cover doing pretty good on the stadium side all right cubone geodude eevee zapdos oh we still need the rainbow birds too and oh nice shiny Glaceon man we only have we don't have that many shiny jacks we're starting to pick up pick up pace as far as that goes but we're getting dupes of those too but you know what uh while i'm not happy about dupes any evolution i'm happy to get any dupes uh wouldn't mind the umbreon and leafeon but hey we will take Glaceon. I feel like there were some rumors about a, or no, there was a couple of vendors that had a Glaceon tin. 
but I was really thrown up by that. Like, I feel like I've only seen it on vendors, never any like announcements. But that would be weird if they did have that. Glaceon is definitely a cool one. Anything that's ice type, I'm a fan of. Freezing Gaze is actually pretty good. I wonder if. Wait, no, this guy's probably out of standard rotation, but I wonder how this would do against Mewtwo. Weak against Metal, so I think that's pretty safe. Frost Bull is not strong enough, but that Freezing Gaze would basically make it so that the, you can't. Uh, opponents pretty to play there. Have no abilities. Right. So. Kind of like a power plant kind of thing so let's see very good opening overall that turned around in that last pack for our unified minds we did get a tortuga and then a curlia number four i think glacian number two and boom a secret rare tag switch so very successful opening and um yeah thanks for watching guys as always like comment and subscribe all down below and uh thanks for all the support on the channel lately things have been great i'm moana turtle and i'll catch you guys next time